It's day five of this year's 105th Tour de France. Simon Gerrans on the road and marching the peloton on towards the breakaway, who are three minutes and 51 seconds up the road. It's Gavidia in the blue who's going for it at the moment. Gavidia giving it everything right now. Gavidia looks as though he's going to get it. Gavidia will get the maximum points just ahead of Sagan and Christophe. And the man just. Oh did. dear, that's Elie Gebert. What did he do? Well, off into. Oh, that looks a mess. That looks a mess. Oh. We see more problems for Mark Cavendish. Not the first time he's been off the back as the road's gone uphill. One to watch. And it's not something I'm taking any delight in saying yet. Oh, and we've had problems. Problems for Chris Froome. Problems for Chris Froome, mechanical, with uh, Michal Kwiatkowski helping him. And now this is what a watch because the racing's on now. We've had another crash, I'm afraid. Dion Smith was one of those riders involved. Juan Fredo was looking the worst off. Anthony Tourgy, who was very close to winning the French National Championship the other day, was there as well. Uh, don't forget, 3-2 on one bonus seconds here, and they could prove to be very useful a little bit later on. Proper battle then for the bonus seconds. The round comes down. Oh, this is great stuff. Real, real pitch battles going on throughout. And uh, Ben Avermaet says, OK, if you want it that much, then have it. Chris Froome could well be uh, salvaging some seconds here because we said, Sean, there's going to be clock reset and only one second gap. This gets the gang going to respond to and 30 meters remaining oh and there it is Gilbert kicks on he's gonna have a dig at this Gilbert goes for it this is absolutely fantastic Laporte won it on his case as well I believe it is uh, Gilbert starts to grind into it this is absolutely fantastic it's uh, Julian Simon in fact that's on his case here's Greg Van Avermaet there is uh, uh, Julian Alaphilippe as well but it's uh, Philippe Gilbert that's having a dig here and it looks like he may well just bring it home 500 meters is he gonna fade he's got Avermaet of course Greg Van Avermaet in the yellow jersey he starts to win he wasn't too sure about it. Cotrelli also very much in the mix. And Sagan looks cool as anything. It looks like he's uh, he's just about uh, at the end, uh, about to have himself a little peppermint here at the end of a feast. Let's see. The dining's not finished just yet. We're coming up and over the top. Oh, and Alaphilippe issues an oath. Didn't like that one little bit. And uh, Greg Van Avermaet still hasn't lit it up. And look who's on his case. The green jersey here of Philip Gilbert. Cotrelli as well. Oh, and a big turn, a big switch there off the barriers. Uh, Gilbert not happy as Cobrelli lights it up. Sagan goes into the centre of the road. Here he goes, Sagan. Sagan coming all the way to the line. Is he going to make it all the way home? Oh, it's going to be a lunge at it. 94 metres. He's still got the grind. He's got the power. Has he got the belief? Of course he has. He's a world champion. And he also is dominating this green jersey competition yet again. Sagan, it's his era, it seems. Another page turned in a history of greatness. Peter Sagan, congratulations. Uh, that was a typical Sagan victory, would you say? Oh, well, I was also a little bit lucky because Combrelli was coming <laughs> close again. Then, uh, yeah, my, my teammates, they did a very good job. From the middle of the stage, they were pulling in the front, Bodnar, Bughar, uh, and, uh, and other guys. Then they uh, bring me in the good position for the final climb, and then... Uh, uh, Sky just started to pull like full gas and then Gilbert just came over and he started uh, he tried to attack but uh, we catch him and after I think uh, Van Averman just start too early and uh, in the end he pulled a very good sprint for me and uh, Colbrelli I think. Yeah it was a typical class classic uh, Arden classic victory here here, uh, here in Brittany. Oh, well, during the Tour de France, everything is different, but, uh, well, it was, yeah, parkour a little bit like Arden, yeah. Up, down, left, right, uh, narrow roads. It was a little technical. It was nice, nice parkour. It's a very good operation for the jersey that you have on your shoulders, uh, the green jersey, of course. Oh, no, I think today was a little bit less points than normally. It was just 30 points, I think, in the front, and better than nothing. <laughs> yeah, and tomorrow is another day. Merci, monsieur. Congratulations.